Our department is called the Department of Nonwovens and Nanofibrous Materials. And I would like to speak about the last branch of both. We have a great advantage because the Czech Republic has a very long tradition in textile industry, not only in the production of textiles, but in the design of textile machines. And no doubt nowadays we are taking fruits from this history. That is why uh, the Czech Republic is a great player in the field of non owens We are focused on the research of development of quite new technologies that are able to provide us with nanofibrous materials. Uh, we are also carrying out a lot of research in the area of application of these materials, focused mostly on the application at um, tissue engineering in a strong cooperation of my schoolmate from Charles University, Professor Evgen Amler. Nowadays we have a huge project in the frame of a cluster that is called NanoProgress. That's a group of universities, institutions and private companies. And we are trying to develop new machines for needless production of so-called core shell or coaxial nanofibers. We developed quite new method that was just now patented for quite unusual variant of electrospinning that doesn't need so-called collector. Nowadays we are able to produce nanofibers with only spinning electrode and the flag of nanofibers is flying and uh, steaming in fact in our labs. I would like also to speak about our effort to develop scaffolds for tissue engineering. And just now we are producing so-called vascular grafts. It means, as a rule, tiny tubes that are made by nanofibers. And in the future we would like to seed living cells, epithelial, and also other cells into these scaffolds to produce artificial vascular grafts. We have in our lab also another method to produce not textiles, nanofibrous materials, but uh, nanotubes or nanofibers made by carbon. This method is called chemical vapor de deposition that is based on the deposition of carbon nanotubes due to elevated temperature from, in our case, from natural gas. We are working on quite new technology that is called drawing of individual nanofibers by a mechanical manner using a micro manipulator that we uh, developed and we are trying to develop such nanofibers as optical probes or electrical probes for, for instance, indication of various chemical agents in the air. Regarding the cooperation with our friends and with my schoolmate Professor Amler, our group in this cooperation provided technologies and materials and we are uh, discussing about uh, chemical modification of our materials and also about the incorporation of various uh, drugs or growing uh, agents into uh, tissue engineering so-called scaffolds. We also obtain a very um, big project just now from the Ministry of Education and uh, between Technical University of Liberec, Charles University and Czech Technical University in Prague, we will establish joint uh, study subject that is called tissue engineering and students will visit it, labs and lectures of all these universities. We also obtain some support to extend our lab of tissue engineering to be prepared to host more students 
We have a very good cooperation with uh, American universities, for instance, with uh, Cornell University and first of all with Clemson University. We are prepared to cooperate in all these items that I have mentioned. It means we will be very glad if it is possible to exchange, for instance, PhD students or lecturers. We are also prepared to cooperate with private companies in the field of development of uh, and application of new materials we are able to produce.